hi guys week is kind of a special week a little bit because it is my birthday this week it's like my birth week starting today today was sunday i should have recorded what i did today um, today is sunday and i went to a cycling class this morning and it kind of kicked my butt and it was at 8 30 this morning this morning i woke up at six six o'clock in the morning and i'm dog sitting so i went to the house i was dog sitting at and i checked on the dogs i was let them out whatever i took a little nap and then i went back home changed and went to the cycling class it's called ride the rhythm and um it was my first time doing it and my mom was like oh let's try it like let's just try it when we were starting oh my gosh like it was so hard like getting into it until he started like being really motivational and he's like it's all in your mind like you believe in yourself like keep pushing keep pushing and so that's what i did and i really pushed through the entire class and it was really fun i was sore i took like a three hour nap really late in the day because yeah after the second class my mom and i got coffee at duncan and we might have gotten donuts too and then after we got donuts we went to church and my sister drove um she actually did a really good job good job for us proud of you church was like good today the songs were great um i was really into the service and then what else did i do then we went to the movies and we saw Good Boys and that was a really, really good movie. It was so funny. That is what I did today. Um, but starting this week, I am going to be doing something fun kind of every day. At least I'm gonna try to. Tomorrow morning, I have to wake up and check on the dog. So I will show you guys that. I'm going to my personal trainer at 10 o'clock in the morning. And then after that, I'm going to a yoga class with my friend, Sean. And I'll probably go dog sit again take a nap i'm not really sure how my day is looking tomorrow i'm gonna have to place it together but i will talk to you guys tomorrow okay um hi guys good morning um i it's monday it's monday morning it's the 19th and i just got to the house that i'm dog sitting at like literally just now um and then after this i am going to the gym and then I'm gonna do a yoga class with my friend. And then I need gas after that. But <clears throat> I will show you guys the dogs. Hi. Hi, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Ah. Okay, let's go outside. Oh my god. They constantly bark at me right when I get here. And then they don't bark at me again like the rest of the time that I'm here. So. Also, I kind of got to sleep in today. I've been waking up at 7 every day or earlier the past week or so just because I've had things to do. Um, but today, I slept until 8. So, um, that was nice. <clears throat> and then I'll probably be here until about 9.40 to make sure the dogs are good. And then um, I'm going to get to the gym. So, yeah. Hey guys, I just finished up the gym. Um, I went to personal training and that lasts like 30 minutes. It's like a 30 minute session. And then I went to yoga for an hour and I'm literally like, I feel good because like yoga is stretching, but if I didn't do yoga, I'd probably be like super sore. Ooh, I'm running a yellow. Hi guys, oh my God, today has been such a busy day. I went to breakfast with my friend. It was delicious. And that's the place that I'm having my birthday brunch at. Uh, we're going to ecstasy. That's what it's called. It's kind of clever, kind of cute. <laughs> and then um, after that, I went to the house I was dog sitting at and I took a nap for three hours. And then I came home and I didn't do anything for a little bit. And then I went back to the house I was dog sitting at, was there for a couple of hours and then I came back. So now it's like night, it's been my time. It's literally like nine something. Um, I'm exhausted and I'm ready for bed. And if I'm not ready for bed, then it's because I'm hanging out with a friend. I don't really know yet. <laughs> So I'll see about that. Um, also, my room has changed a lot. I don't even know if I've shown you guys my room. Lighting in here is horrible. But yeah, this is my Monday. It's been really boring. I'm very productive. But tomorrow I have my interview. Or a job interview. The final one. Then I find out if I get the job or not. And I feel like if they tell me they need to call me, I probably didn't get the job. But, um. Um. Then after my interview tomorrow, I don't really know what I'm going to do. But before, I'm going to check on the dogs one last time. And then I'm done dog sitting. Thank God. It's a really easy job, honestly. You just have to clean up a lot of poop. Or maybe I just do. Maybe I got really unlucky. I don't know. But yeah, that was my Monday. Yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hi, guys. Um, It's Tuesday. It's the next day. 
and I woke up at 8 this morning to go check on the dogs one last time and that was the last time I like dog sat for them so yeah um and now well after that I got breakfast with my sister because she missed school she's a bad kid not really but we went to first watch I haven't been there in a really long time because I found a new breakfast place I like but um yeah um and then after that I just dropped my sister off at school and now I have my final interview for this job and I find out if I get the job or not I'm really hoping I get it obviously I'll let you guys know if I get it um and yeah I'll see you guys afterwards Today has been such a long day. I'm so ready to just take a nap, but I can't take a nap because I'm going to get Dutch Bros. <laughs> Why? Um, I guess because it's my birthday week and I want to treat myself, you know? Um, but I probably would have said yes to Dutch if it was any other week, not gonna lie. But my outfit's cute. Yeah. All right. Also, I got paid for dog sitting. I don't know if I said that already, but I got paid almost $400. My friends, MJ and Elena, asked me to hang out. And um, so I got my belly button pierced. And now I'm going to my yoga class. So we're going to see how sore I am afterwards. Honestly, it didn't hurt that bad. Also, like... Um, it's probably not a good idea to go to yoga right after getting your belly button pierced because it's all about stretching and I literally will lay down on my stomach. We're going to see how it goes, okay? Like, Tuesday's been crazy. And it wasn't that expensive either. I went to Ratatat Tattoo Parlor Shop and um, it was only $25, so it was a good price. Um, we're going to see how long it lasts, though, because I feel like after today, it's not going to be that long. So, okay, I'll see you guys after yoga. Hi guys, I just finished yoga and um, it actually wasn't that bad with my piercing. Today was such a good day and my friend says she has a surprise for, for me tomorrow for my birthday. So um, I'll bring you guys along. But okay, have a good Tuesday night or whenever I post this night. Okay, bye. You hey guys, I just showered um, and now I'm washing my face if you can't tell. It's still Tuesday. Um, I wanted to show you guys my belly button piercing, but like I can't right now because that would be inappropriate. But I'll show you guys like after I wash my face. Also, I need to brush my teeth and I need to clean the piercing. So, um, we're gonna do that. Okay. Good morning, guys. It's Wednesday. Um, I already got ready, but I got to sleep in today. I slept until like 9.20 something, which is pretty late, but I forgot to show you guys my piercing, so I was gonna do that. It's like little, but it's still cute. I really like it, so. Today, um, I have to go pick my sister up from school, and then after that, um, what am I doing after that? I just pulled my neck. After I get my sister, oh, um, my friends wanna like surprise me for a birthday present, so I'm excited about that. They told, they told me to like get ready, but make it like look casual. I think I'm gonna change the shirt I'm wearing, but, um, uh, I just want to show off my belly button a little bit. So I have to find a shirt that'll do that that's kind of more comfy a little bit. Yeah. Watch. It's like your shadow moves and then you can like <laughs> <laughs> Today I went to the Phoenix Art, or er, no, 
I went to Shane, oh my god, the Scottsdale Fashion Mall, and my friends surprised me for my birthday, and they took me to Wonder Space, I think that's what it's called. It was like this really co cool museum, and we took a lot of cool pictures, and um, after that, I picked my sister from school, and tomorrow's my actual birthday, so... I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow. I literally, I don't think I have any plans. Sorry, I have like my nails all over my shirt. I've been biting them. I am just waiting for my birthday tomorrow. I'm really excited. I'll probably do like a dinner again or something or get Dutch with a friend or seven. We're just gonna see where the day takes us. So yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, guys. Oh, this is just not gonna be a good angle. That's fine. Um, but good morning. It's my 19th birthday. I feel so old. Um, <clears throat> my sister woke me up this morning, and she woke me up a little early so we could go get like food. And she let me drive her car so I don't have to waste gas. I thought that was so cute and nice. So yeah, I got Dunkin'. I got Dunkin' coffee and a donut just because it's my birthday. I can have a donut. And um. I just dropped her off at school, and I was waiting on getting Dutch Bros now, but, like, my stomach cannot handle, like, a coffee right now, and then more coffee, or I don't even know what I'm gonna get. I might get a Rebel, but, like, they're so big that, like, if I finish that, like, I'm gonna have the worst stomach ache. So, like, I mean, it's also, like, my birthday, so, like, do I care? No, but, like, should I? Probably. Um... But I don't know, like, it's so weird. I, it's literally so early right now. I might just, like, go back to bed. And then I have to pick my sister up from school. And then I don't know what we're gonna do after that. What is this car doing? I should've just gone. I'm not ballsy with left turns. But, um, yeah, I'm just gonna go back home right now. And then kind of see how the day plays out. See who, like, reaches out to me or, like, whatever. And maybe I'll hang out with people or something. I don't even know what I'm gonna do. I guess we'll just see. Um, and yeah. See you later. Um, so yeah, today is my 19th birthday. Um, that feels really weird. Um, it is my last year of being a teenager. I don't like how that sounds. It just sounds like responsibility and taxes. Um, some good things about turning 19. Um, it's not much different than turning 18, obviously, but I believe now I can buy a ladder. So um, if you guys ever need like a ladder, I just like kind of celebrating my birthday because I get to do like a bunch of things with like my friends and like they feel obligated to because it's my birthday, but I just like like hanging out with them and doing things with them. So, <laughs> but yeah, um, last night I had the hardest time sleeping because I had like anxiety. And so um, I went to bed, I want to say like 11, like I was, it was so easy to fall asleep, but I woke up at like three o'clock in the morning and I just had like, like just like a weird feeling. And then I was like, oh, happy birthday me. And then I woke up again at like five and then woke up again at like six. And it was so hard to actually like fall back to sleep. But, and I don't really have any set plans for today, but whatever happens, like I'll just show you guys what I end up doing. Like this morning, my sister took me to Duncan. Well, I took her to Duncan and school, but she paid, which was really nice. And she let me drive her car and everything, but I can't figure out how her Bluetooth thing works um, in her car. So the entire way home, I was like swerving and it was silent and it, was, it wasn't it was very fun. And then I'm gonna pick my sister up from school afterwards and see like what she wants to do, if she wants to do anything fun. And then I'm gonna drop her off at school again. And then um, I just, I don't know what the plans are for today. So I just need to figure that out. Um, I'm probably gonna go to like a bunch of different Dutch bros because that's just like a birthday tradition for everybody in Arizona. Like, but today just feels so like weird. Like this whole week I was like, yeah, like I'm turning 19. Like nobody cares. Like 19 is not that cool. Even I don't really care about being 19. I just care that like, it's kind of like a new year and a new fresh start a little bit. Like 19 is like a cleansing. And now it's like, okay, like, like what's in store for me? Uh, and I'm kind of excited because I have, I just got a new job. But yeah, I'm kind of waiting for people to wake up. It's literally like not even 8 a.m. But I'm wide awake, so. 
yeah, I think I'm gonna go upstairs in my room and watch the movies. Maybe clean my room. I really need to clean my room. It's horrible. Hey guys, um, so my friends are gonna come pick me up and then we're gonna go to Dutch Bros. And then um, I have to like pick my sister up and stuff, but we're gonna go to like a lot of Dutch Bros, um, which I already said we were gonna do, but that's what we're gonna do. And I kind of look cute, but like I'm a mess because my sister wanted to do my hair and stuff later. Um, and so I'm just gonna shower later so she can like blow dry it and curl it for me because she can do that. So, yeah, um, I'll see you guys at Dutch. <laughs> <laughs> hey! Freeze frame! <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, um, so we're about to do an escape room. Whoa. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't remember which theater. What was it called? Just the theater. It's just called the theater. It's called the theater. And we're gonna figure it out. They said like the quickest time was like 20 minutes, but they said no, not to make no, it competitive. They said it wasn't. They said like oh. one time they told the parents it was 20 minutes. Oh, and so they stopped doing that because it's not competitive, but we're still gonna try and do it under an hour. With my new jersey. <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> Oh my gosh guys so we just did an escape room and i couldn't really like talk about it while or like film it because then the escape room would have been ruined and the, that would have upset them and but me and megan won <laughs> but she had to go and i have to go too because i have to go get my sister so um that's what i'm doing guys i just showered because i felt gross and now i'm waiting for my sister and my mom to come home and they're being sus because they're 20 minutes late i think they're getting my cake I'm excited though. Oh, yay. Okay, I'm even more excited. Sorry, a notification popped up that made me really happy. Um, um, I have a dinner tonight at uh, Whiskey Row. I'm really excited about it. It's a really fancy place in Arizona. I'll show you guys and I'll show you guys everybody that comes and stuff. It'll be really fun. And uh, I'm just really excited. Today's been such a good day. And I'm exhausted though. I've been up since seven. Okay, seven. Oh, it doesn't zoom in. Okay. Um, but yeah, I'm just waiting for my family to come home. Oh my god, so many people have reached out to me today. This is so weird. Like last year, um, I wanna say probably like, you know, there's your Facebook friends always say like happy birthday to you. Um, but like probably like four people said happy birthday to me last year. And this year there's been so many. Like it's been really nice. It's been really nice. Thank you guys for all the birthday wishes. I really appreciate them. Just finish. Take your time. Meow. Um, I just finished dinner at Whiskey Row and I did my makeup <laughs> and took like a couple pictures. I look pretty cute. Um, in those and um, I had a lot of fun. The music was loud. The food was really good. It was pretty cheap actually. And um, yeah, today's been a good day, but I'm super tired. Um, I just want to go to bed.